The next method we'll be taking a look at is the background eraser tool. I cannot fully recommend this method since most of the time it doesn't do its job that well, but here's a case in which it may actually help. To select the background eraser tool, simply go to the context menu of the eraser tool and pick background eraser tool. Then click on your foreground color and use the color picker to make sure that it's the same as your background color. Once you found the perfectly matching color, click OK and then use the crosshair of your background eraser tool to guide around the background. It'll help in areas such as this tight spot up here and will definitely improve your accuracy. You can also mess around with the limits option from the background eraser menu which can be set to find edges, contiguous and discontiguous and you can also increase or decrease the tolerance. Most of the times you do not need to do this however since the background eraser tool is just fine on its own.